News 5 at 5 starts now. He's too the old to protect and serve, but an Akron police officer is now on the other side of the law facing child pornography charges. BCI agents arrested Officer Jeffrey Parker, who was then booked into the Summit County Jail. News 5's Bob Jones broke this story for you this morning and now tonight brings us the very latest on what we know so far about this case. Investigators tell News 5 that a tip about Officer Jeffrey Parker came into the National Center for Missing and Exploited Children, also known as NCMEC, which then made a referral to the Ohio Internet Crimes Against Children Task Force in Cuyahoga County. BCI agents took over the investigation and the officer was arrested on multiple counts of pandering obscenity of a minor and illegal use of a minor in nudity-oriented material. It's always um, shocking to, to hear that somebody in a position of trust would be doing this. We unfortunately know, based on the reports that we see, uh, that this does span all walks of life. Fallon McNulty, the director of the Nick Nick Cyber Tip Line, couldn't talk specifically about the tip regarding the officer or any allegations against him, but she said in general, tips from the public are crucial to protect children. Last year, the agency received 36 million reports. Those reports are so important because this is the upload of child sexual abuse material, the instances like online enticement or sex stalking. Parker has been on the police force for four years. Akron Police Chief Brian Harding said, in part, I am sickened to learn of these charges against one of our employees. Anyone engaging in this behavior should be held accountable for their actions to the fullest extent possible by law. An Akron Mayor Thomas Mollick said in part, I find the alleged behavior of Officer Parker to be disgusting and morally reprehensible. Tim Dimoff is a former Akron police officer, a private investigator now. Just what's your initial reaction when you hear that it's a police officer accused? I think it hits home, it's, it, it strikes harder, and it's, it's more disgusting and more disappointing because we put our professional people at a higher level. This is the second time in two years that an Akron officer has been accused of crimes against children. Former officer Michael Dillon, who secretly filmed and inappropriately touched a young girl, got 13 to 17 years in prison. Parker's case now expected to go before a grand jury. According to Akron Police, Officer Parker is on paid leave per department procedure and the union contract. The president of the Akron FOP Lodge told me the union does not condone any criminal behavior and the FOP is not representing Officer Parker in this criminal matter. In Akron, Bob Jones, 